all right what's up guys out there uh i'm gonna do in this i'm gonna show in this tutorial uh how to still get uh like steam workshop mods like where you can get them and i'm also going to show you a tool that you need to uh extract like gmod models and materials or whatever really simple and easy i don't see any tutorials online for it and uh i mean i poked around online trying to find a simple way of doing it and uh this is the best way i could find to do it so i'm just gonna go ahead and jump on here i got the links i'll leave them in the description for everything so let's go get this over with <laughs> okay so the first thing you're going to want to do is uh, make sure you have like 7-zip or p-zip or whatever i'll leave a link to the 7-zip uh, you're going to want to get on like uh let's see like the workshop of course and get a mod or whatever like uh i'll just click on one to show you how to do it you just pick whatever mod you want and you go up here grab the url uh, copy it and then what you want to do is go to this site since the other one got shut down which is really just stupid in my opinion but then you just uh control v copy it in there download it and uh once it downloads you'll want to put it in its own folder so you can extract it but you're also going to need uh this right here on mod db uh where is it uh, oh wait wait a minute my bad my bad <laughs> i had to run the whole thing yeah this was created by uh, zombie slayer 103 back in i think 2019 is what it said when i was on there yeah it's uh gw tool or gw tools and you will need this to uh, convert the legacy.bin file. So you want to grab that. Okay, now we got everything we need. I'm just going to use an old uh, Gmod mod uh, that's been abandoned since like 2012, I think, to just uh, show how this is done. Okay, this is Resident Evil 5 uh, weapons for Gmod. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to create a folder. I'm going to throw the zip in it. Go into the folder, right click it, and extract it here in this folder with whichever, you know, thing you want to use. If it's just a .bin file, you'll have to use 7-zip, I'm pretty sure, to just extract files here. So I'm just going to use p-zip to extract it here. It should be a legacy uh, bin file. Yeah, it's a legacy.bin file. Okay, then all you want to do is open up GW Tools. Okay, you got it right here. This little tiny window is GW Tools. You grab the legacy.bin file that come out of the mod that you just extracted. Drag it over and drop it in it. Okay, it's going to turn the legacy bin file into a zip. Okay, when you click it, you notice there's nothing in it. So what you want to do is just right click it again go extract here again it'll pop up with an error hints about the error just ignore that click it it'll drop another legacy.bin file okay you click that one throw it back in gw tool again boom there you go resident evil remake weapons materials models add-on and i mean it's that simple to uh, get your uh, gmod models or whatever uh, i use them on anarchy arcade because uh, i love anarchy arcade and i love making my own arcades but i love to have models from gmod and move them over to anarchy arcade but i'll leave all that in the uh description like all the links and stuff for you i hope this helps you a lot and uh, thanks for watching my video remember if you like my videos like subscribe and uh, if you want to see something, let me know and I'll see what I can do.